When it comes to colour, you might think you've seen it all. But this is no ordinary shade of black. It's actually the closest thing on Earth to nothing. It's called Vanta Black, and its British creators think it could change the way we see the universe. It absorbs 99.96% of all light, and that's just the light on the electromagnetic spectrum visible to the human eye. Ben Jensen is one of its creators. A Vanta is a vertically aligned nanotube array. Um, and the black is obviously self-explanatory. So that's because the material that you can see here is made up from an array of carbon nanotubes. Now, carbon nanotubes are a nanoscale material. So to give you an example, so the hair on your head, if you took that and split it about eight to 10,000 times, one of those strands would be the size of one of the tubes in the array. So you can think of this like a, a field of grass that's exceptionally long. Okay? And what happens, light particles, for want of a better word, go in and they bounce around inside that field of grass and then they're absorbed by the material. So very little will come back out. The technology behind carbon nanotubes isn't entirely new, but what Jensen and his team have managed to do is make it usable. They found a way to bind it to materials like aluminium foil, a material with properties similar to those found in satellites and telescopes. It means that photos taken of the Earth and the universe could become much more accurate. And if you get stray light, i.e. light from non-target objects bouncing around inside the telescope, it increases your signal-to-noise ratio and you don't get such a sharp image. If you use this type of material inside the telescope, coating baffles and uh, aperture plates and things like that, that stray light is reduced and you get a much sharper image. Material can never be 100% light absorbent. That would break the laws of physics. That's not stopping Jensen from making one final claim. Yeah, you, 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 yeah, absolutely, you could say that. The closest thing to um, a black hole, I could say, it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a fun comparison. While the technology is still in the process of being licensed, it could herald advances in stealth camouflage and reconnaissance photography, along with other applications as yet unknown. Just how big a breakthrough Vanta Black really is, though, remains to be seen. No, Google Mail.